entire sternum is the target of this attack. In a submission match, the name of the game is to make your opponent tap out from a submission move. There have been so many submission specialists throughout the history of this great business. Brett Hitman Hart, Kurt Angle, Brock Lesnar, William Regal, and Daniel Bryan are a few who come to mind. And on the women's side, I think about Alundra Blaze, Natalya, Becky Lynch, Charlotte Flair, and the boss, Sasha Banks. Corey, earlier you spoke about a submission match, and one thing I'd like to point out is that a submission match is not necessarily the same as an I quit match. The key difference is that a submission match requires the use of a submission maneuver. In an I quit match, victory can be achieved by bringing your opponent to the point where they quit as a result of the overall punishment they've received in the match. That's an important distinction, Michael, especially since a superstar can win an I quit match by using the submission maneuver. For superstars who aren't proficient in submission moves, they enter this type of match at a disadvantage. It doesn't mean they can't win, but they need to perfect applying the submission move quickly. Come on, Corey, try and keep up. When we talk about submission matches, we have to speak about one that, in many people's eyes, set the standard. It was WrestleMania 13. Bret the Hitman Hart was in a heated rivalry with a brash star on the rise named Stone Cold Steve Austin. This match started like no other submission match, with the two superstars battling in the crowd and attempting to use ring steps as a weapon. Byron, you mentioned the submission match between Bret Hart and Steve Austin at WrestleMania 13. The rivalry between the Hitman and Stone Cold was so intense that WWE had no choice but to appoint mixed martial arts champion Ken Shamrock as the special guest referee. The Hitman didn't waste any time focusing his assault on Austin's injured knee. Steve Austin was busted open, and in the ringside area, it looked like a tornado went through. Once locked in the sharpshooter, Austin refused to give up. Stone Cold passed out due to the excruciating pain, which was considered a submission, giving the Hitman the victory. If it's not the greatest match of all time, it's certainly in the discussion. Submission time! She better do something fast. She works her way out of the hold, and I don't know how. That was locked in pretty good. Check out the torque on the back. Whoa, impressive. You could say that again. I never thought she'd break free from that one. And she got her with a clothesline. The end may be near, folks. This is not at all where she wants to be right now. Yeah, but we all know she's a fighter. Don't be surprised if she finds a way back in this thing. One of the things a superstar who's competing in a submission match has to be careful of is if they have an injury or have been injured in the past and people know about it. You can bet in a submission match that your opponent is going to target that body part immediately. It's like having a giant bullseye on an arm, leg, ankle, or shoulder. This could be it. She's, a, she's not playing any games tonight. Everyone better watch out. Even me! Victory is on the horizon. Look at her go! I don't know how much more these superstars can... Ah, oh, she gets out of it. She has renewed life now, Michael. A mammoth slam right there, guys. She's an amazing athlete, but I don't see how she rebounds from this. She may have just hit a wall here. These women have gone through so much in this match. It's amazing that they're still able to stand. A minor miracle might be needed to overcome this beating. 
submission time. Clearly not what she was hoping for when she appeared. Oh, an incredible job breaking free. But you have to imagine there will be residual effects from being caught in that hole. Well executed. What a comeback. What a sweeping blow. Going for broke. You're not going to win many of oh, no. She's in a bad way now. Nice. Shut it down. And she's able to break out of it. The lesson to learn here, Cole, is that you can never count her out. She clearly liked the results from the first time she delivered that move. The second time we're seeing this here. Look at this. You can see the pain on her face after that slam. Look at this. Going for an encore here. And we're back to this form of attack. Looks like she wants to beat her inside the ring. She's calling her out. One more shot and she's done. She's in control. Just a giant blow to the jaw. She's in full control now. Oh, this is dangerous right here. Whoa! There may be no escaping this fireman's carry. I don't know. Never say never, Cole. She certainly landed that one. Back now inside the ring. Putting it all on the line. Incoming. Russian leg sweep. Keep your eye on this one. Look at this. We're looking at complete domination here. Bringing it back into the ring. This is going to be big, one way or another. Incoming. Startles her with the uppercut. I guess she feels there's something to be said for going back to something that worked before. Kick on the mark. Well, I wasn't sure if she was going to come back down or not. What a move. Uh, going to the top. High risk. Torque on the back. Her gutsy performance will be remembered forever. Let's take a little look at some of the action from that match. Wow. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Epic. Here is your winner, Chen Lee. Big win despite absorbing a huge amount of punishment there. I can honestly say that a win is a little more satisfying when you make your opponent tap out.